We close tonight with a mystery that has wildlife experts on the West Coast baffled. A sea lion pup is now in a California rescue center near San Francisco. This after he got lost. Wait till you see how lost. Here's Danielle Nottingham. This little sea lion pup named Hoppy is only 10 months old. But oh, the adventures he's had since being separated from his mother. Sean Johnson is a veterinarian with the Marine Mammal Center near San Francisco. He was out in the world trying to find his way and try to figure out where and how to catch fish, and somehow he ended up going the wrong way. Did he ever? It's believed that Hoppy's odyssey began in Southern California off the Channel Islands. He migrated north, then under the Golden Gate Bridge into San Francisco Bay and down the San Joaquin River, 100 miles inland. He then hopped out of the water, waddled over a mile before being found in an almond orchard. How bad was Hoppy when you found him? He was near death when we found him. And his main problem was his malnutrition. He was really skinny and we could see his ribs. And because he had probably been in the fresh water and, and running around in the dirt for a while, his hair coat he was missing some of his hair. But after two weeks, he's come a long way. Hoppy is now recovering with nearly 200 other sea lions and seals. Most were found beached, underweight and starving, then brought to the Marine Mammal Center where they're nursed by volunteers like John Carlo Ruley before being returned to their native habitat. That's where they belong. We're a rehabilitation hospital, we're not a zoo. We really would like to see them successful eating fish out back where they belong and that's the ocean. Yeah. On Friday, we followed seven sea lions on that journey home and doctors say Hoppy could soon follow. He's looking great compared to when he first came in. Hopefully he can find his way this time. Danielle Nottingham, CBS News, Sausalito, California. Now that's a happy ending.